Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. Why am I singing the song? Hey everyone, it's Multi Game Master One, and welcome to my 100% Let's Play of Super Mario Galaxy 2. <clears throat> Sorry about that. <laughs> um. Anyway, welcome to Super Mario Galaxy 2, the Let's Play. Um. Last time we had a prankster comet challenge in Bowser's Galaxy Generator. And also accepted a challenge invitation from the Chimp in the Slimy Spring Galaxy back in World 6. And we began exploring the special world and completed Super Mar not Super Mario Galaxy, uh, Mario Square Galaxy. So now we're going to continue on from this point. However, I want to show you guys one funny thing. If you come to this mail toe here with Luigi, you'll see that the letter is addressed to Mario. And there are five one-up mushrooms in the letter. Huh, it's addressed to Mario. But don't worry, Luigi, I'm sure it was just a typo. Yeah, so I hope Luigi is not too disappointed. Anyway, let's just continue on with the adventure by continuing to explore World 6. Not World 6, World S. I'm sorry. So we can now advance, and we need at least 75 power stars to get to it. But we're good to go because we have 110. So, off to the rolling coaster galaxy we go. Rolling Coaster Galaxy, Episode 1, The Rainbow Road Roll. Okay, so here we are in the galaxy, and to get to the Power Star, we're just going to have to roll this giant star ball to the end. And I'm not going to worry about the coins and the star bits along the way because... Well, from this point, there's not really a necessity to pick them up. Go, go, go! So, so, slow! Stay under control! Yeah, I see what the toads are doing there. Trying to motivate me to survive throughout this galaxy, and this can be potentially difficult. Experts, stay right! I may not consider myself to be an expert, but I am at the very least well experienced, so I will go right. And there's the comet metal right there, if you take that route. And I was starting to wonder where that was exactly, I never expected it to be there. Right here you just want to be really careful. And I'm not going to bother with those star bits because they will potentially slow me down. Or, in this case, throw me off. So, onto this railing we go. Almost there! Okay, and indeed we are almost there. We just need to make our way through this carefully. Very carefully. And now from here, it's just a straight shot to the goal. And this is actually one of my favorite rolling galaxies pretty much for that reason. With the goal reached, the power star is ours. So we can advance dead ahead. However, we have a Prankster Comet challenge in the Rainbow the Rolling Coaster Galaxy. So we're gonna go back and take on that challenge real quick. Before we move along. And I'll come back later and view how many stars we need in order to keep going. Right now we have a challenge to go through. So, Prankster episode. Purple coins on the rainbow road. So I believe that for this purple coin challenge, there are more than 100 purple coins. You need to grab at least 100 of them in order to complete the challenge and get the power star. And also we have 2 minutes in which to do this. So let's do this rather quickly. Collect 100 purple coins! There's only 110! Okay, so there are only 110 purple coins. Coin you do it? I will try to. Yo, 
you can miss up to a total of 10 purple coins, but as soon as you pass that about, if you don't have enough by the time you get to the end, whoa, careful, then you won't be able to get the power star. And in this ball, we actually have another purple coin inside it, so I guess that's one for us. And I think I'm missing quite a few of these, but hopefully I should be able to get through this in one try. So right there I missed three, and fell off, unfortunately. But I really do like the rainbow row for this galaxy. Very colorful. Are you serious? Okay, if I die one last time, I'm going to cut to the part where I left off before. Come to think of it, I prob before recording this episode, I probably should have gotten more extra lives. I'm a little bit worried right now. But the least I can do beyond this point is to stay confident. Okay, so over here, more purple coins down the ramp. I'm gonna try to slow up a little bit. Although, with a slope incline as high as that, I can't really guarantee that I'll be able to slow down. So we're halfway out of time, but we're halfway done. Okay, so roll along this path here. I missed three purple coins, but I don't think from this point it really matters. Okay, so let's just make our way forward from this point on, with nearly 30 seconds left on the clock. Okay, careful, careful, careful. And I'm just gonna grab two more of these and then cut straight to the end. Oh, there was another purple coin right there. And there, and there. And also the purple coin inside the ball. And here's the gear mode that expects us to collect all 100 purple coins. You really did it! Amazing! So, once again, to get this power star, it took me two deaths and three attempts in order to get this, but you can't really expect the special world to be easy now, can you? It really is a true test among the universe. So, I hope none of you guys hold it against me. And I'm not hurting too much on deaths from this point. I'm just trying to stay alive from game overs. So, let's see, how many lives do I have? Eleven? Well, I'll be good to go beyond this point. But if I need to come back for any extra lives whatsoever, I'll cut the part out and just meet you guys back at the galaxy. But anyway, we need 80 power stars to advance. We have more than enough to get over there. So right now we have 112 power stars, and now we can reach the Twisty Trials galaxy. Twisty Trials Galaxy, Episode 1. Spinning and spinning and spinning. Does this seem familiar to anyone? Mario, you want to do guest commentary for this? No. I'm good, multi-game. There's not much to cover here anyway. You go ahead. Okay then. So, in this galaxy we have the return of Super Mario Sunshine, more specifically the secret of Rico Tower, episode number 4 from Rico Harbor. And to get to the Power Star, like before, you just want to make your way to the end. 
and I probably recommend saving as many of those cloud flowers as you can because they could be useful in allowing you to get to the end and you're going to notice that the design here in this galaxy is different from what it was before and the slopes won't be so easy to walk up on like before in Super Mario Sunshine when you thought you were gonna fall but then you walk on the slope and then you just keep going from that point here it's different you can just slip off really easy and here's the comet metal for this galaxy I was thinking I needed a cloud in order to get to it but I guess not so we're almost to the power star already and success we have made it So yeah, there are certain there are certain situations in which galaxies are short, and that's how I figured that it won't take me like too many episodes in order to complete all of the special world. So don't expect too many more episodes out of this. So we have a prankster comet in the Twisty Trials galaxy, and before we move on, we're going to take on that challenge next. So back into the Twisty Trials galaxy we go. Prankster episode. Turning, turning, double time. So as you can see, everything is pretty much spinning wildly out of control now, and there's no time limit to get to the power start in the galaxy, you just want to make your way for it. Try not to fall off as you go along. And I believe that Yoshi can be found in this galaxy so that he can help you out. So I'm gonna see if I can find him dead ahead. You just want to keep moving around at all times so that way you'll stay alive. And we have plenty of 1-Up Mushrooms on the way, which could suggest that the challenge isn't going to be so easy, and here we have a checkpoint, the first checkpoint that we've seen in a prankster uh, challenge. And now, here's Yoshi, so let's just use him to keep going. And I'm just going to wait for the spinning platforms for a moment. Okay, now from this point, I think we can make it across, so... Thank Yoshi's flutter jump, I got through that. Okay. Careful. Oh, thank goodness I didn't fall off. Okay, so moving right along. That's probably like the trick and trickiest part to this prankster episode in this galaxy. Okay, so moving right along. I know I'm missing quite a few star bits, but it really doesn't matter beyond this point. What matters most to me is just getting through this without hopefully dying. Another 1-Up Mushroom here. And as you can see, the Power Star is not here. We actually have to go a bit further into the galaxy in order to pick it up. So we have plenty of more spin spinning platforms. And boy, are they really turning double time. But it's a good thing they're not going quadruple from the Beat Block Galaxy back in World 3, and from this point, I'm almost to the Power Star, hopefully I can reach it without falling. Okay. Oh, that was tense. Honestly, that really, really was tense. Now everything is completed in the Twisty Trials Galaxy, so now we can move on from that point, and I think I have time to cover at least one more galaxy. So, we need 90 Power Stars in order to advance, we have 114, so we're good to go. And right before us, we see a galaxy that's quite familiar, which is the Stone Cyclone Galaxy. 
Let's go ahead and get a closer look. Stone Cyclone Galaxy Episode 1 Silver Stars on the Cyclone So here we have the return of the Giant Cyclone The Giant Stone Cyclone from Super Mario Galaxy 1 And our mission here is to DIE! I was referring to the Octumba. Our mission here is to... Collect all five of the Silver Stars whilst avoiding all of these enemies. I'm wondering if I can actually make this. I don't think I can, so let me go back to see if there's a switch somewhere. Here indeed is a switch. Ground pound it in order to slow down time. It will be pretty useful in helping you navigate your way through here without getting crushed. And clearly there is no fast bow comet in this galaxy's orbit, so this could be a lot more tougher than what it was before. Okay, so I'm just gonna wait that one out real quick. Then go ahead and ground pound. Hopefully I can get underneath it in time. The tox box. Okay. And here's the second silver star right here. And I saw earlier that there was a comet metal. But I need to slow down time in order to get to it. And then jump on this stone. Grab the comet metal. And at this point, I think we're going to move on. I don't think there are any silver stars around here. But I'm just going to check on this on this side of the planet just to see. Here's the third one. And thankfully, I got out of the way in time. So is there another switch around here somewhere? I guess we'll find out as soon as we get past the tox box. And there it is, right there. Yeah, this is very difficult this time around. Okay. Uh, fourth superstar right here, and I think the last one is dead ahead, and there it is. And right here, there was a there was supposed to be a thwomp, but apparently Nintendo decided to replace it with those stones, those moving stones. But with all five silver stars, we can get the power star. There are moments in the special world which can throw you off. But as long as you stay calm and just go through the challenge, you'll get through it. So I said earlier that I was going to make time for one more galaxy before ending the episode, and this is our last galaxy, so I'm just going to get... the Power Star from the Prankster Comet Challenge in the Stone Cyclone Galaxy, and then that'll be it for this episode. So back to the Stone Cyclone Galaxy, we go. And I have a feeling that things are going to be much tougher this time around. So, Prankster episode. Toxbox Speed Run. So we have the return of these clocks, which means another time challenge. And I'm not sure what it is that we have to do here, whether it is to grab Silver Stars or to just get to the end, but we have 20 seconds, well initially we had 20 seconds, to either reach the Power Star or grab the Silver Stars on the way. Tox box. That gets to me sometimes. I think we have to reach the end, so I'm just gonna rush right through this. I thought for sure that was going to crush me. 10 seconds left, I really need this clock. Okay, rushing right along. 
Here's another one right here. And I'm just going to follow closely with the tox box. And then make a long jump through here. Get under this tox box. And I'm really running short on time, so I really need a clock. And of course I messed up on it. Okay, so here we are again where we left off, and from this point it should be easy to get to the Power Star. And I knew that this wasn't a Silver Star mission, I just wasn't really sure of it at first. But if it was a Silver Star mission, it would just make things a lot more difficult than what it was before. I've done quite a lot for this episode, so I think I'm going to end it off here. And in the next part of Super Mario Galaxy 2, we're going to continue our expedition in World S by finishing the rest of the galaxies that we see out there and hopefully recover the rest of the Power Stars. And if I recall, there should be 120 Power Stars total. So right now we have four more to get, and next episode we're going to see if we can grab the remaining ones. So, until next time, I'm Multi Game Master 1. Thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later.